In the vast expanse of our cosmic neighborhood, astronomers have just made a discovery that's sending shockwaves through the scientific community. Remember 3i Atlas, that mysterious interstellar visitor that had us all scratching our heads? Well, hold on to your telescopes, because what we've just found makes Atlas look like a cosmic dust bunny. Meet C2025R2, nicknamed Swan, an astronomical object that defies everything we know about celestial bodies. Picture this, a massive object, 100 times larger and brighter than Atlas, cutting through space with a plasma tail so wide it could span five full moons in our night sky. But here's where things get really interesting. This isn't your typical space rock. What's caught the attention of scientists worldwide isn't just its size, but its seemingly impossible characteristics. Swan appears to have a nickel-cobalt armored hull. Yeah, you heard that right. And what looks suspiciously like a plasma drive exhaust. Its core is pumping out more energy than two colliding black holes, which, by the way, shouldn't be possible for a natural object. But wait, there's more. In what seems like an astronomical impossible coincidence, Swan's trajectory perfectly intersects with 3i Atlas. Both objects will vanish behind the sun in October 2025, creating a cosmic blind spot where we'll lose sight of them completely. Dr. Avi Loeb, a renowned Harvard astronomer, has proposed an intriguing theory. Atlas might be the scout, while Swan is the fortress, possibly part of a probe system on a mind-boggling 22,000-year orbit. Some researchers are drawing connections to our own technological advancement. Could these objects be part of an ancient surveillance network, awakened by our radio and television broadcasts reaching into space? Graham Hancock, known for his alternative historical theories, suggests that our ancestors might have witnessed Swan's previous visit, encoding this knowledge in the precise alignments of pyramids and megalithic structures worldwide. The timing is uncanny. Just as humanity reaches a technological threshold that allows us to detect such objects, they appear in our neighborhood. Are we witnessing the return of something ancient and artificial? Is this a response to signals we've been unknowingly broadcasting into space for the past century? As we track these objects' approach to our solar system, we're left with more questions than answers. Is Swan truly a comet with bizarre properties, an artificial structure beyond our comprehension, or perhaps something even more extraordinary? A reply to a cosmic message we didn't know we sent. Whatever the truth, one thing's certain. October 2025 could be one of the most significant moments in human history.